Okay, welcome to a uh, installment of Meat Eaters Hot Tip Off. Go ahead, Danny. Uh, my hot tip is when you're uh, calling elk, mm-hmm. um, but mo- more importantly, when you're calling them, just to sort of locate them, still always be ready for one to just pop up right in your zone. So have your bow close, maybe not be standing right on the trail. Um, but even when you're just doing locating calls, be, be ready. Dude, when you're napping, you got to be ready. That's right. When I'm napping, I got my release on and I can lay my bow next to me because I've been burned. I've been burned in the middle of the day. Seth? Seth Morris. Mine, mine kind of goes along with that, but it has to do with glassing. When you're perched up on a glassing knob, a lot of people get hung up on glassing far. That's what I do. Glassing far. And then the camera guy's like, well, what about that one yeah, right there? Yeah. Sometimes <laughs> there's one just right there. And people get overlooked like this morning. I, that, we were glassing far and that bull was just close. I'm glad you gave that tip because I'm always the guy who's like, kind of like, it's almost like I'm in a contest to see who can see one the farthest away. Yeah. And I get burned often when you look and like there's a buck looking at you right yep, there. I got burnt real bad this year doing that. Yeah, it's a good tip. My tip? Is on bow hunts. Um, always have an extra release. Keep an extra release with you. I've seen some people have to make some hellacious drives to go buy a new release. Um, I don't take it on and off a lot. I kind of leave it on generally. But have an extra release in your pack and put it in the last place that would ever be possible for it to get away. Like shoved in somewhere where you pretty much would forget about it. And there's no chance when you're messing around that you're going to pull it out. And just have it be there. I just thought of a tip for myself in the middle of my hot tip would be to clip that thing to something. Because, like I said, man, I can save you major headaches. Extra release. What do you think, Chris? Who do you think wins? Uh, I, th- I think it's a draw across the board. Three way tie? Three way tie. Sweet.